Anahita, I want your perspective on this being a lawyer, because we're seeing stand your ground as a possible defense here. And that, to me, is baffling. Let's take a listen. I want your take on the other end. Okay. What started the okay, that unknown object, witnesses right. say a bag of popcorn. Wow. The judge said no justification right. for pulling out a gun on Ahita. Stand your ground. Here right. we go well, again. Clearly, clearly he's arguing self-defense, Lynn, and he's saying that I was defending myself, that I was struck in the face by something. I didn't know what it was at the time. It turns out that it was a bag of popcorn, yeah. but I feared for my life, and so I was defending myself. And if that's really all he has to go on, then good luck trying to succeed yeah, on that defense. I don't think that's a very strong defense. Mm -hmm. For self-defense, you have to have reasonable fear, and you have to have an evidence that's being raised right. and exposed. So, Anahita, we sure. No, you're absolutely it right. Like the more it has saying, nothing to do with standing ground. Where does that leave us now? I was saying, where does this really leave us now? Are we going to start having to have armed guards, like at the movie theaters and schools, at malls? This is just happening far too frequently, Lynn. And, I mean, people don't want to feel like they're walking into a prison when they're going to the movies. But, sadly, I think this is where we are headed. And Shigun, I think do you we need agree? to really emphasize that... that do He's you think cop. that there's any reversing this? Do you think that we're ever going to go to the movie? This is about fame, theater. though. I don't think this is about fame. I think no, I that think this might fame. actually be more of like a mental health issue going on right. here. And yeah, this, this guy is was something a former Lynn, you talk about. about this, but let me just say one thing. Fame, but I do. No. Hold on. Yeah. On a heat. Lynn, I will admit, I am guilty of this type of behavior. Um, I think we're all just getting used wow. to, like, snapping pictures, selfies. This is what I'm wearing. Let me post it on Facebook. This is what I'm eating. Let me post it on Instagram. I think it's something that we kind of have to get used right. to. And let's not forget that Typical sometimes people move. are using these incidents mm. as a way to get their 15 minutes of fame. Because if you're posting this train wreck yeah. on YouTube and, and it's going viral or you're posting, you know, pictures of people fighting like the shark. Keisha video that we saw a few weeks ago on this show. People are getting famous off of these videos, and these are the, the Wait, train Anahita, wrecks that's that go fair. Hold on, Steven, because I, hold on, hold on. I want to go what you're saying. Maybe to do what is right. Shagoon, I see you on Twitter. You do it all the time. What Anahita said is it right. Guys, no, Anahita, Mark, listen, I'm not I'm not the most important person in the world. But I like to think that my life matters and that the lives of other people are intrinsically worth value. I'm not That's going not to film point, a car accident no without checking that, to Shagun. see the if someone's okay. The point is that we are becoming desensitized. Mm -hmm. People are more concerned, sadly, these days with, with, you know, posting a picture of a train wreck, a car accident on Instagram, recording it and uploading it But it doesn't it make YouTube. it right. That's what people are more concerned with. And you know what? Sadly, a lot of us are guilty of that as well. And we as a society... No, 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 no. Sadly, these not guilty. But viral. We not like guilty. Not guilty, wrecks. Your Honor. Not, 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 not guilty.